accusing the Uttar Pradesh administration of making a mockery of the constitution. Three former Supreme Court judges are among 12 prominent persons who have urged the Indian Supreme Court to react to the violence and repression by state authorities against Muslim citizens protesting over BJP's representatives' remarks on Prophet Muhammad peace be upon him. Their letter to the court specifically terms the bulldozing of houses of protesters an unacceptable subversion of the rule of law and requests the court to take a suo motu action. The prior Graj Development Authority bulldozed the home of Javed Ahmed alleged to have been involved in the June 10th violent protest triggered by now suspended BJP spokesperson Nupur Sharma's controversial remarks on the Prophet. The properties of two persons accused of rioting were bulldozed in Saharanpur too. The coordinated manner in which the police and development authorities have acted leads to the clear conclusion that demolitions are a form of collective extrajudicial punishment. Videos of young men in police custody being beaten with lattes, houses of protesters being demolished without notice or any cause of action, and protesters from the minority Muslim community being chased and beaten by the police are circulating on social media, shaking the conscience of the nation, reads the letter. The letter reminds the Chief Justice of India that on many occasions, including in the recent past, the judiciary has faced such challenges and emerged with distinction as the custodian of the rights of the people and must act accordingly to stop the rising prejudice against Muslims in India.